Hello there, this is Space Center 5. Welcome back to episode 8 of our Byzantium Let's Play series, where last episode we had to deal with a coalition where we're being attacked from both sides. The Mamluks, the Ottomans on this side, the Pope, Naples, Florence on this side, and Genoa. So, we kind of got attacked by both sides. We had our faithful ally of Bohemia and Muscovy to defend us. Muscovy was kind of dealing with their own war with Kazan, and France decided to break their alliance with us. We are allied once again, just because they are basically a meat shield for us right now, and the next time we have a coalition, I'm going to give away a lot of their land, because they've picked us off now. <laughs> to say the least, we are sitting on a giant mountain of military points right now, which is actually not what we really want right now. We need like more, more Diplo, more admin right now, because we are currently lose spending two on Diplo relations. Crystal expansion impact is actually very nice, but... Not quite what we need right now. We do have our royal marriage here with uh, Milan, just to see if we can get a PU on them real quick. If we do get a queen consort here, we are going to push a PU on them very quickly. We are still sitting on mountains mountains of military points. Uh, sure, you can have some. We have way too many. I'm not even bothering to like dev click, do the proper dev clicks, because we have too many. Uh, we'll piss both of you off. That's fine. I'm not too concerned about that. We do need to go ahead and start rebuilding our navy, because uh, we sacrificed it a couple times. Go ahead and make sure we uh, we won the war. One time just to see if we could actually do it, and then the second time to go ahead and stack wipe 35,000 here in Constant Constantinople by blockading the streets. They couldn't flee, and they all died. It was great. It was glorious. And that's kind of how we ended up ending the Coalition War. And it looks like everyone has an air right now, which is hilarious. That's very abnormal. But the game does go through eras of periods where this is a thing. We want admin. Uh, that's missionary maintenance. It just saves us money. We're going to fall further behind in admin tech. I think that's okay for the Deus Vault CB. Very nice. Although we don't quite need it right now, but we will in the future. Bulgaria, we, Bulgaria is paused right now, just so we, uh, we go ahead and finish our ideas. Or at least the next two ideas, we're just going to integrate them immediately. Probably would have been better just to go ahead and integrate them due to the uh, dipple points that we are losing per month. But, you know, it's, it's neither here nor there, you know. Clergy is upset. That's fine. Uh, we don't have enough admin points to actually go full state everything right now. That is what it is. Let's see. That was our heir, wasn't it? No, that was Queen Consort. Ah, that's fine. We are 67 right now. We are kind of expecting to die here soon, which means our royal marriage with Milan will end. So you're 66. How old are we? We are 67. So we are kind of expected to die before these guys, which may mean our PU or chances of PU are rather limited. Cap the military points again. Is this just military tech? Yes. And I think this is going to give us unbalanced research though, right? No. Good. I didn't want to. <laughs> I didn't want to have it. All right, go ahead and get new cannons, new cav. I always forget which ones because I don't bother looking. England lacks an air. I don't think we have any say in that one, right? Can't throw our weight around on that one? Nah. A Borgia will actually pick up. Mm, why a Borgia? The Borgia Pope isn't in, in, uh, in office right now. Is he in... It's not even a Florence. Milan is also not a Borgia. Uh, is it a Naples? No. All the locations where Borgia typically exist do not exist. Interesting. But okay, fair enough. It might be just one of those name fillers that the game puts in sometimes. Crimea? Uh, yeah. Poland, you've done a thing. We'll go ahead and fight you. Uh, once we are actually in a state, we can do that. We do need power projection though right now. Go ahead and send an insult to you, make it scornful, spend a little prestige, just go ahead and get... Should have been. Are we not rival to them? Oh, we are not rival to them. Oh, we'll go... Go send an insult over... Oh, this is where the Borgia came from. Let's see. Yep, Juan. No Borgia Pope. This is the son of the Borgia Pope. Nope, this is Juana. Where's Juan? Was it Juan? I was just the brother or the son, one of the, the eldest son of the Borgia Pope. You don't remember anymore. Ajam, who are you fighting? QQ. Mm, yeah, I'm not really interested in that one. All in due time. 
Go ahead and continue to convert our lands, give us that religious unity, and reduce the unrest in our country. Be glorious. Sugla, you're being converted. That's the only reason you're upset. Not too big of a deal. Our truce with Hungary is going to be ending here soon. July of this year, or of next year, which is in a month. I think it's time. Uh, Hungary, who are you allied to? Munster and Naples. Oh, my friend. That is not going to be a fun war for you. We're going to go ahead and feed Transylvania as, as much as we can. I'll go stand there for now. See, there is the fort here. It is being... Oh, it's all... It's all being maintained. That's no fun. Yep, they're all maintained. Oh, well. We're going to be able to easily enter. Naples is currently being besieged by rebels, so they may not end up joining. That will be very nice. And then we'll go after... Ooh, free stab. I love free stab. Dipple points. That should be enough for the idea, right? Yeah. Go, yeah, we'll take it. And now we just want our diplo annexation. We're gonna have send one diplomat. We're gonna go ahead and improve relations with Transylvania because we may end up just immediately integrating them. To be honest, they've been around long enough to start their integration. And if we finish both at around the same time, I'd be fine with that. I mean, yeah, I'll do it for the innovativeness. To be honest, it's June next month. We can go ahead and go to war. Actually, we go here. Who's with Hungary? Declare war. We're going to do a reconquest. Do we want to do a reconquest? We do a conquest. I think we do a reconquest, feed them back all of their cores. You don't have a core here, which is always funny because it has Ruthenian culture. Never makes sense to me. Mm, and I can already take the Austrian land. That's fine. We'll go do a reconquest. We'll go for Zemplin. That's fine. I'll both of you guys in because you owe me. I'm back from Venice. Do I need you in this war? If I enable Scootage. You're not going to join the war and I can just return your land. It's not going to be an issue. But then if I want you in later, it's going to be an issue. I won't do it. You can come in. We'll go for Zemplin. Go, we'll go here first. Uh, Bohe Do we not call Bohemia in? Uh, apparently not. Come on in, Bohemia. Uh, I'm going to use France later. France, actually, if you have money, I'll take that. We have 58 favors. You have money? I can take 4,000 soldiers. Mm, rather not, actually. I don't need your your troops. I need your money. How about the Muscovy? You got money? Nope, you don't. Oh, you're at war too. Oh yeah, you're defeating the hordes. That's fine. You do that. Seems like a, a much better option. Or down south. Not going to be too concerned about that one. Taxes. No, how about production? 0.2 ducats. Sure, we'll do that. I know I do need to, to do a building for our, uh, our diet. But that's fine. Naples, you're so annoying. I may just, like... Actually, I kind of want to take Naples in this war. We're not going to do that, though. We'll just white piece you. Just so we get the short of truce timer. Hungary, you're going to fall very quickly. We're going to go ahead and return that, 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 that. Go. That's actually perfect. Um, if I were to release anyone... Mm, not worth my time, to be honest. Could take the one province and release Wallachia. That could definitely be a thing, but I already have too many uh, vassals. I don't care about that. Just anything is fine. Anyone for PUs? Nah. Alright, we're waiting on this one siege then. Go, great. The Italian Wars apparently is a thing. We'll go over down to Naples. Uh, you guys should actually be over here, like, blockading, doing stuff. Be fine. <clears throat> Siege is going to go well. Where are our vassals? Oh, Theodora is fully occupied. Actually, we may go ahead and start integrating you guys as well. Forgot about you guys, to be honest. Hmm. 
we may end up integrating uh, two vassals or three vassals all at one time. Give us the Patriarch Authority, gives us our uh, conversion speed, all very nice. Uh, we have plenty of military points, we can go ahead and spend that real quick. Teach is over, very nice. Bohemian, you obviously want this land. I'm not going to give it to you, though, because I honestly have precedent over you. <laughs> oh, you did get the faceting. Uh, to go ahead and... Uh... Oh, no, is it... Yeah, normally this is gems that are producing glass now, so you did get the faceting of that, very nice. So I'm pretty sure, unless I have that backwards. Which, you know, it could be. <laughs> could definitely be a thing. Thank you for already taking the war goal. Very helpful, very fruitful. Munster, you're sieging out Bulgaria. Bulgaria, you know, you could just protect yourself, right? And let's go ahead and work on the last province that we need to convert through our faith. Very nice. Naples, I can't go ahead and revoke any of your cores over here because it is all your uh, primary culture. I do want to go ahead and sink your navy, though. In its entirety. Just so I don't have to deal with it ever again. You've annoyed me. In the previous war, Scotland. Oh, we died. Yep, that was to be expected. 055. Oh, the 202 is bad, though. Goodbye. Ah, uh, France. Yes, we will take a royal marriage with you. Bohemia, we will as well. Milan, you're 69. I don't even know if it's worth it. Like, it, it's probably worth it, but also, like, meh. Just for a chance at a PU. Yeah, it's probably worth it. Going back with Theodora, they'll be the easiest to go ahead and get back in line. Who's not our faith? Transylvania, are you not our faith? No, you're not. We're going to go ahead and convert you, or forcibly convert you and force your religious unity. This will give you a 50 religious, or 50 uh, liberty desire. It's 50 for if they're inside your uh, your religious group. And it's 100 if they are not inside your religious group. So we're going to go ahead and do that and convert them. And we'll go ahead and help them since we're pretty much done converting ourselves already. Capture some trade ships. Very nice. You guys go ahead and go back. Remerge. Bulgaria's getting sieged down. I don't care, to be honest. Alright, Naples, you're done. Peace. Uh, you can keep your cores on the island of Sicily. That's fine with me. Um, You can go ahead and end your... Oh, no, we just want a white piece. Is your money worth it? Not really, no. I'll do it just for money. Goodbye. Alrighty, Hungry. It's time for you to die. We are going to return all of our cores. You are going to lose your cores on us. Uh, and keep that one because it doesn't give us any prestige. And then I guess we're just going to go ahead and take some money. I have no idea where the Hungarian army is, though. But over here, probably. Looks like the innovativeness will cost us some prestige. That sucks, but life goes on. Taking Wargle is in our favor now. Wonderful. Plenty of money in our pockets. You guys are fighting Bulgaria. Oh, there's the Hungarian army, actually, in its entirety. Wonderful. Extra meal points. Can I have Diplo points instead? All right. Income from vassals. Very nice, but not quite what I'm looking for. You guys are going here. We shall say hi. We shall greet you in the fields of battle. Hello. Apparently you guys are faster than us. We'll fight in the woods. Nope, you're still faster. You have four maneuver pips. Mm, yeah, that is enough to get away from us because we have none. We have a 5-4 leader though, so we are meant to fight. Alright, monster, your army can die. Nope, you're faster than us too. Everyone's faster than us. Alright, Transylvania, your integration is going to start here very soon. Did take a river crossing penalty just because we have bad maneuver, but that's fine. Where are you going? Hungry? Where are you going? Uh, 262, I will definitely take that. Glorious. This is a strange location for you. Oh, well. I think you're ready for peace there, Hungry, to be honest. We're going to get all of that. We'll take this one province and we'll give it over to uh, 
Pennsylvania. And money? I don't really need the money, but sure. This does increase our truce timer. Go. Politics. Transylvania. Stop improving. Transylvania, we will go ahead and give you this. Uh, Bulgaria is no longer unhappy with us. There we go. <laughs> we have to pull, pull everything just to get them unhappy. Alrighty. Uh, is it time that we go fight Austria? Probably. I don't mind splitting Austria with uh, Bohemia, to be honest. Transylvania. Yeah. It's that. Annex you. You're 360. That's fine. Go ahead. Oh, you need a little bit more opinion. That shouldn't be too big of a deal. How are we doing? 7 out of 6. Muscovy and Bohemia are just alliances. We have Wittelsbach, who are not our dynasty. Go Muscovy. Austria, you don't actually have that many friends. We shall go for show superiority. Who's the emperor? Is it, is it you? Oh, it is you. Tell you what, it doesn't feel like it. Gotta wait 11 days. Not a problem, we shall casually wait. We'll declare war. This will also give us some power projection, just because we're declaring war on you. Ten. Works for me. Uh, and you're not just a friend. All right. We'll go over to Vienna. Now I have military access through here. Uh, is Hungary just going to give us military access? Maybe. No. All right. We're actually going to go deal with Brandenburg immediately. We have plenty of money. Let's go and see what we need. You need a barracks. I can definitely do that for you. There you go. Not a problem. The armies march through. You're going to go defeat Brandenburg. That's great. Um, I don't... You're going to end up losing that battle, though. You you needed to wait for the Byzantian reinforcements. Relax. Oh, Brandenburg just died. There you go. Full stack wipe. Walk over here. Oh. I accidentally ran over an Austrian force, I'll be honest. Sorry guys, didn't mean to. Go for that Diplo rep to increase the rate that we integrate Transylvania. We definitely don't need you anymore. Where is this dude? Give us something better, please. Extra Diplo points. Uh, we definitely like that. Ooh, we got the reform. I don't need the military tech. I need the Diplo tech cost. We'll do that. I definitely probably would prefer the army tradition, but yeah, it's 47. We actually have very even. Don't take tech. Tech is the wrong thing. That's Bulgaria integrated. Very nice. And then next one we get our Diplo reps. That's fine. I'm not going to worry about that one. All right, Bulgaria, you're going to be integrated now. Bye. Lends the heresy on you guys. That's fine. Triumph in the Balkans. We're going to put you off on the side for a little bit because that's just free army tradition. As well, you guys go ahead and walk down here. That's fine. Theodora, we're going to start working on you. Get that going. All of Bulgaria can just get fully stated without any issues. You're already stated. Perfect. Uh, you guys must have some devastation from being raided on the coast. That's fine. Not going to be too uh, disinterested in that. Cranberry's 26. Uh, how about England? I don't think you like me very much, do you? Nah. What about marriages, though? Maybe. Just maybe. Because we want to look for anyone else who we can peacefully annex. National unrest reduction, very nice. We'll take that. Still have plenty of military points. We're going to go ahead and do that. And that's the coalition ending. Or, uh, peace with the former coalition. You guys are being occupied. Transylvania. Could go ahead and just... Seize your development. I'm not really interested in that, though. That's fine. This is going to be a big chunk of Hungary, part of us. And then we'll do Wallachia next time. 
We may just go ahead and just conquer these five provinces and then release Wallachia. Go, there goes Brandenburg. Uh, go south. Brandenburg, you obviously are not feeling well. That should be apparent. Come on back to Theodoro. England, you just need to be happy with us. Sure, give us the Patriarch Authority. Not too big of a deal. You, my friend. Staten don't care. Where's your religion? You're too big. These allies are a lie. Who are you actually allied to? We break all of your alliances. Yeah, Austria, Hesse, and Walgast. Walgast. Austria. Strasbourg. That's all your allies. Give me your money. Um, give us some war reps. All right, Bohemia, occupy that one province, and it'll be done. Goodbye. There we go. Yes, I was very generous to you, Byzantium. I have done nothing to you. Oh, hi, Austria. I'm not sure you want to fight me in the mountains. <clears throat> guys did meander on south, which I don't appreciate. Little 1k instant wiped, and then you came and attacked us in the mountains. Thank you. We appreciate that. And you guys are going to try and walk out. I don't think so. To be honest. Go there. Goodbye, Austria. What do you got? Diplo relation? Uh, yeah, we'll do that. Means we actually start maybe doing PUs. Maybe. I'll walk over here. Say hi to Austria's army again. Extra military points. Thank you. Stack white. Yeah, I'd pretty much say Austria just had has to roll over and die right now. Like, that was uh, that was brutal for them. See, I want these three provinces coalition wise. Just hungry, that's fine with me. Um, and then I think we'll do a humiliate just to give us more power projection. And we'll go ahead and go for some war reps and I guess ten clicks of cash. Bye, -bye Austria. You now no longer can have these boats. Not a thing for you anymore. Do that and port. Wonderful. Bosnia, are you part of the Empire? Just kind of curious. You are. Well, go ahead and bring the army around. Uh, not that way. Let's go this way. There we go. Let's see. There are quite a few people actually died. Bosnia, Laxanair, I'm not interested in that. M Munich, maybe? Uh, I don't think we'll ever get you. Alrighty, Theodoro. I'll go ahead and prove relations with you. Going back from England, That's that, that was a dream. I mean, you're 72 now. We're going to go ahead and get that royal marriage with Milan going. You're 72, my dude. You just have to be our dynasty. All right, so who are you fighting? Strasbourg and the Three Leagues. Well, that definitely means the Empire is pretty much dead. Nice. All right. Munich, maybe. That's Munster. Uh, it's Munich, the one over here. Yeah, that one. Oh, I don't really care about that. Okay. Army is walking on back. Not too big of a deal. We have the Holy War CB on the Mamluks, because... Oh, they just integrated their vassal. I can release Karaman now. That's 707. We're integrating Transylvania right now. You're going to get integrated here very soon. Go ahead and influence your nation. Give us 25 opinion. It was only 60 ducats. Yeah, it's nothing. We'll send you a gift next. Bosnia, who are you friends with? They're part of the empire, but I don't care. These three are being cored very quickly. This will also reset our truce timer with Austria, which is fine with me. This is at war with the Pope, which is also fine with me. 
versions. Very nice. Full stack wipe of the Austrians. Austria is going to get beat up very quickly. Brandenburg. Uh, you might be an option too. Do we care about you? You really don't like us, I see. Never mind. We will not do anything then. You did not get rid of that port. We're going to do an artillery brush. <clears throat> Flames on the Ottomans. Well, we'll deal with that in just a minute. Who's doing a naval landing? Say no to the Pope. Pope is bad. Uh, piss off the Ottomans. I don't care. The Ottomans don't matter. They're insignificant. None of our allies can join us because we're technically we got around the truce. Um, yep, France is continuing to expand. France, how are you feeling? Eventually, you're going to be a very strong rival that we'll have to fight. You may want to go ahead and start creating some favors with them to go ahead and get their integration. Or just put an, an heir on their throne. That would be very, very potent for us. Looks like they landed their troops. Not a big deal. We're going to go ahead and blockade Rome itself. Austrian friends. Who is Kohlberg? You seem relatively new. There's the Age of Reformation. Okay. Honestly, it hasn't expanded very much. This is actually looks like a very weak Reformation, I'll be honest. There goes the fort in Austria. Extra Evan points. We appreciate those. Go ahead and just go for the base modifier. In the long run, it's better. And we're going to take Vienna very quickly. Go ahead and do another artillery barrage. Let that go. How are you doing over here, Milan? You are 74, my dude. You are ancient, is what you are. I don't really care about anyone else. Thankfully, we have more military leaders. We don't have any siege leaders right now, which kind of sucks. England, of course you have military acts. Oh, you're fighting Austria. Who's Austria fighting? Us and England. English recon reconquest. Ah, uh, against Burgundy. Very nice. You have no air. Do you still... Too far away. What's your real reasonings? Neutral attitude and distance between borders. I can dream. And dream I will. Castile lacks an air now. What happens if you die? Just a Lancaster. Nothing fun. Alright, fair enough. Uh, Transylvania's having a bad day. To be honest, but that's okay. Both forts are getting ready to fall, but if we peace out Austria first... Oh, nope, they got that fort. Not an issue. Well, there goes Vienna. Go ahead and walk across. Austria's ready for peace. Super peace. I'll take your money. Goodbye. Still a shorter truce timer than what we had. Yeah, you guys are kind of stuck. Let's go peace out the Pope. We're going to go ransack the uh, Rome. Probably could take it for ourselves. Try and end the schism. Kind of funny. Let's see. Trade. Go ahead and get a couple of those buildings because we have not focused on our trade whatsoever. Production is bad. Taxes is mediocre at best. And a little extra manpower will do. That's fine with me. I do want this war over relatively soon. 7k there. Who do we got? We have two crappy vassals in Transylvania is what we got. Yep. Make our way over to Rome. We are blockading it. It's looted. Do a neighbor barrage this time. No difference in the cost, so not a big deal. Bosnia, how are you feeling? We ha oh, we was like we haven't really done any battles. We're gonna have a naval battle here that'll give us the war score that we need, though. Not to worry, Poland. How are you feeling? Still got your PU in Lithuania. You got Danzig. Teutons are still around, though. The so Teutons would actually take vassalization. England. I don't know if you ever. Uh... Yeah, you're getting closer. I don't know if you'll ever actually become diplorup. That'll help though for a real marriage. Suddenly, someone will join. Who wants in? Bohemia wants in. Mm, I don't really need you, though, to be honest. These cores can continue to progress because Austria is no longer a thing. Bosnia, you haven't accepted this as your primary culture yet, hilariously enough. That's really bad for you guys. All right, what do we got here? Advisor cost reduction, very, very potent. 
Yeah, we'll do that. For now, we'll go back and we'll go for the admin free policy, probably. Maybe. If I remember. Probably won't. Let's be honest. <laughs> That's not a thing I'm definitely strong at, is remembering random things. We have a Diplo Rep Advisor. I'll go for Morale of Armies guy. It's better production. Go for a missionary. Include subjects. Province is under siege. Alright. We gotta wait on that. All of our vassals are happier. Cool. We'll take it. France, you're at war with Ferrara, evidently. Uh, it's due to Switzerland. Ah, you were helping Switzerland. That's what it is. Yep, well, there goes the Rome. This would take a stop there. There went the entire Roman fleet, or I guess the Pope's fleet. They're not Roman. Don't be uh, heretical. All right, we'll take your money. And your alliance with Naples, because we're going to be attacking them relatively soon. There we go. Thank you, Pope, for all of your money. Bosnia, you've insulted us. Hmm. I, I don't think that was the wisest thing you could have done, to be honest. Guys, go ahead and take this guy. He's got actually quite a few maneuver pips. Just go react by that so we can get our cores going. Denmark Laxnare. Oh, both your PUs. Actually, you integrated Norway already. You have an Oldenburg on the throne. Interesting. Teutons, we're going to improve relations with you. Uh, Because you're not a vassal of anyone. No. Mm. All right, Landhut, I destroyed your army. This war is over. Lose stab? No, I lose money. Money is a, is a much easier thing to lose. You have no siege pips, so it doesn't matter. You're going to walk on everyone's capital and piece them out without any issues. And it's over. England, no luck, right? Yeah. They're still neutral. If they were no longer neutral, we could probably do it. Fifty-eight. I mean, that's good enough reason for us. We can go ahead and send an insult over here, make it scornful. That'll appease quite a few people, most notably England. That ninety-seven opinion. <clears throat> are they a great power? They are not. Oh, they are. They're the eighth, right? Yes. So I can't influence them. Austria died. Okay, that's fine. Don't don't particularly care about that one. And we get that royal marriage. I just need your opinion to no longer be uh, more friendly. There you go. Now they're friendly. Beautiful. That means they'll go ahead and give us that royal marriage, and we can contest their throne. Oh, we got our icon. Uh, let's go ahead and pick it back. Let's go for that proof relations and aggressive expansion. Just makes everyone a little bit happier. England, we are going to have that royal marriage. It's going to be glorious. And we're going to try and get a PU on you. That's really all. We definitely don't have the boats to get over here, but that's okay. We'll get there somehow. Uh, Lanto, you're actually pretty enthusiastic. Rebels in Thames, that's fine. It's kind of annoying, but it is what it is. Let's go and convert your guys' land, since we're going to have to convert it ourselves. And Holt has meander on all the way over here. That's fine, my dudes. You guys enjoy it. England is the only one we have right now as an option. There goes Landhut's capital. We'll come on down here for a second, just to occupy Bosnia. So peace, and goodbye. You're going to annul your alliances with Austria. Very nice. Appreciate that. Rebels there, not too big of a deal. Natural scientist passed away. Well, that just means we pick up the missionary. It'll help us convert. Uh, you guys are sieging my, my Bulgarian land, which is kind of annoying, to be honest. Go there, you occupy that. Bosnia, I just want your full annexation. That's all. Uh, we'll go here, and then just come on down. Poland, who are you fighting? Why are you in here in my land? Fighting Genoa. Ah, so you're going for this, this bits of land. I do want that land myself, so be careful. Just saying. Alrighty, England, how are you feeling? Very enthusiastic. 
is definitely going to be our heir on your throne because you're 59. And that is all the time I have for today. If you enjoyed today's episode, please like, subscribe. Have a wonderful day.